robot to the top roll of clock, and we wanted to do two things. It had to be able to hurdle, and it had to be, sorry, it had to be three things. It had to be, no, it had to be two things. It had to be able to hurdle by throwing, so not hurdle by facing over, hurdle by throwing, and it had to be able to knock off two balls in the time. So the idea right now that's being presented is basically about a four foot high robot with a top roller claw and a two bottom forks. We drive up to the ball, ball two forks will be underneath, you roll the ball into the forks, you lift the ball up to a level where your top roller is not above the bar. So let's say that this is the bar. I'd have my roller weighted here and the bottom forks here and I'd throw it over so that I can go by without having to lower my arm and, and stop. Any throwing devices? In the air cylinder? The Release screen. the bottom arms a little bit. Yeah. Turn, turn the roll belt backwards and give it a shove. Oh. In the box of your arm. That will ring on it. 16 ounce box of <laughs> I like it, I bet I've got Can it place on the overpass too? It would, you, in order to place on the overpass, you lift it up top. higher and reverse the top. Reverse the top. And then you kind of spin it over top of the bar too. That would be made of a match. 